So, for a great pleasure to see the of our other positions in Tokyo. So, uh, I'd like to thank the organizers and take some comments. So, uh, now I, I'll talk about the most promotion of the moment. On the X, we are under the Y here, we and S is a formulation. And I suppose some final information support of our project. So now uh, the usual information theory of F. So there is a lot of about that. This is so inside here there is open subset, it's for the well. And the inside there are equations where all apps are wrong. And then it's not. So this kind of is normal. This is all of the dynamic space. So how to calculate the space? So this, it's a, it is a difficult problem, but uh, theoretically it's clear. So the, the Taylor coefficient, Taylor coefficient, if I determine by the word A. So there are some code A, B, G. Standard multiplication from L to For example, if L is two, then this is just the omega there is. But there are higher multiplication rules. So uh, for example, if x is entry, so this is it's up here in the top but yesterday. So and then it's a series, that means endomorphism. So in this case, and there's a separate structure. This is uh, a skewed method by the Japan on the generator. This is good. This is the structure of the modern space. And in that way, yeah. Uh, what is it? It right. It is given by using this algebra structure that is equal to the sum of ML star on V i, where V1 to Vn is a basis. So by putting back by, uh, by this, you get a non commutative polynomials on, on the coordinate of E1, and in this way, it provides us a power-sensitive structure. So, 
And, and that, as I said, this is M2. M2 is skewing it. So what, what does it mean? This means that M2 spread M2 star is, is something like uh, some minus something. So because of this skew symmetricity, I need minus here and plus. So that that means that if if n is two, then this is just commutative. But the, if, if if n so the n if n n is the dimension of t one, if n is a four or more, then uh, this this relationship is not such because t two m m is just one in this case it's this. So the T1 has one equation, then it is not sufficient to have So uh, the result is not commutative. So the modular space, commutative modular space is smooth, but the non-commutative modular space has a following form. It's not understood. So, so this is the you normal know, one. Okay, it says something more about what's the modular problem on C. So but uh, the form. So how is that formalism or the formation theory is just the same as the committed case, so that's not not much more. So, for example, the existence of Basel family and also the convergence are put in the same way. So, there, there is a work by Godard. We look at some. So. Uh, but there is uh, one new feature of, of commutative deformation that is multi point deformation. So this, this is the case where the field has direct some decomposition. So, for example, x, f is the is here, f2 is here, and so on. And the data are deleted. They are not destroyed. I mean, this is support of f1, support of f2. So that if they are deleted, then they deform together. So, and this is so K to the S model besides OX node. And in this case, the base ring, the base ring, base ring of the convention. Augmented and yes, algebra. So that means there is ring of motion from S to R and going back. The composition lines are identical. This is the augmented case algebra. R has the composition into matrix form. So R, R acts on X and R I J sends J to F. So the, the action of the base ring is matrix form. And F is, of course, a deformation line to assume that F is F. So this is the normal is it is still but uh, not nothing.
So, but so why I need to try this kind of multi point deformation? Because uh, I'm dealing with non commutative algebra. So, non commutative semi, semi local algebra is not a direct product. So, then, so if there are two maximal ideas, then there's some. So, even if you are considering Alkinian algebra, the, if there are two maximal ideas, then the, the total Alkinian algebra is not a direct product of two algebra. So in the community case, that this is direct product. So, that is, so that reflects the so relation. So, it's a that they, they add something. At the same time, so this is uh, one new feature. If you take organization on the base thing, then this is uh, so commutative deformation, base space of commutative deformation. And if R is buffer, buffer density deformation, then arbitration is buffer commutative deformation. So that modular spaces, so the three case, modular spaces like this. So you have a smooth commutative modular space. That space, and then at each point, you have a more. But if you look at the point of the non commutative modular space, then this kind of thing disappears. So, what, what is point? I mean, close point of the modular space, this is a homomorphism. So the base field K it is C. But then it, it factors through arbitration. So if you look at the set of points, then there's nothing new. So just to factors through. Uh -huh. Yeah. So, this, so if you want to see the modular space closer, then this structure disappears. So if you then this is like a phantom. <laughs> Okay, so in this talk, I, I'd like to present you some examples. The first one is uh, the, the trivial example. The second one uh, is the uh, most interesting one. That's related to mirror symmetry. So there's a couple Ah, ring, a ring, ring, So, but if, if you are ring commutative, then the same thing happens. But if you non commutative, for example, if you take R itself, then of course. Yeah, uh, point, yeah, two sided maximum line. Two sided maximum line. Okay, the first example, so example zero is so G M N, and it has open. So that, that is a modular space of M-dimensional vector space inside 
and dimensional fixed vector space. And there is a fine open subset. This is homomorphism from W to D over W. And it has coordinates A i j, where i is 1 to m, and j is from m plus 1 to m. So this is a rectangular matrix. So this is commutative uh, modular space. And that is non commutative modular space of uh, m. In this case, so the, the ring is K of AIJ divided by AIJ I dash J dash minus AI dash J dash. Yeah. And then ARJ. So, so that's J dash. That's J dash. ARJ plus ARJ plus J I plus J minus A I plus J. That's, yeah, that's all. So, again, I have a, a combination of commutators, and uh, not all commutators appear. So, in this way, the modular space is a little bit more than the So, and the, so of course, this is quite, looks quite artificial, but uh, so, it, for, for example, if you Consider the P of P in X and then so W, P of W. And suppose that uh, this is a line and this is Calabriao. Then uh, the modular space of line on Calabriao is just to uh, describe. So it has a, a quotient ring of this. So this kind of uh, so not, not, not so simple commutator appears as a more in a, in a more com complicated and a more important way. And then this is the second topic So this is a, a flopping contraction. So this is so F X flopping contraction of smooth three four and exceptional locus is a union. So this is a favorite subject of a three four. Uh, that, yeah, so I, uh, so some of the people belong to that generation, and uh, I, I like still that this kind of example. So uh, yeah, and uh, if you take generic hyperplane section, generic. This is device reality, and this is partial resolution. And the exceptional car locus is uh, this the same car. Yeah, and and if if S is one, then uh, color defines then of the exceptional locus. What is a length? Length is the uh, length of the scheme theoretic fiber. Well, of course, you can define length for arbitrary S, but then you need 
best times lengths, lengths. And then uh, Katz and Morrison proved that so length, length cell. L can be one, two, three, four, five, six. So this kind of number appears ten times in the um, in normal cell. But I think uh, Slava likes this kind of number when you started complement. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ah, QQ is a QQ is important. Then Q is not So, I have a contraction of the point, this is y, this is x. Then I get generic deformation of the y. That, that is also proper contraction, but there are many cuts. And so these are C cases. And the one of the C cases is um, minus one minus one. And C K T is the general. Some of the cards deteriorate the and some some cards deteriorate the So so that I can now so, and this so this, this statement is a kind of categorization of the immediately planet. That's why I, I, want, I want to say that it's not communicated deformation as some kind of higher degree deformation. Degree one case that it is not communicated deformation. Higher, higher degree, you know, more. Feel. 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 Yeah, so anyway, this, this is a very special case. Yeah, the, the definition is cheaper, so this is coming back. So if this is general, I can still consider that I'll go back to my work in variant. So CKP degenerate to in this case and then I'll get just a summary of okay, the I have the same. So, yeah. That's the same. So, now how, how to uh, So, uh, this, this kind of expression looks very difficult. But actually, so there is uh, the work of uh, London. That made the calculation uh, accessible. So, suppose x is the step of b, and let fi is a line angle phi, that's the phi. And this kind of line number exists. And usually, line one, one, F is the 
extra ri inverse. So this is no vanish. So this is degree minus one. So in the reduced fiber, there's no cohomology. But in, in the non reduced fiber, uh, some non vanish cohomology may appear. So I want, so in order to kill this, so I, I consider the point a sequence. So, so, so that R1 dual is So, if, if this higher direct image doesn't vanish, then add more. And then finally, I get this. Then P is isomorphic algebra. Plus. So this is no commutative greater resolution. Ah, this is A. Instead of the Crepant resolution Y, well, this Crepant resolution Y is replaced by algebraic Crepant resolution A. So Y is geometric and A is algebraic. The difference is that the fiber of Y has infinitely many points, but here A has only discretely many set rows. So the fibers are Fine subjects. So this this is more accessible by our aspect method. So now the calculation is reduced. The calculation of a prefix. So the vertex is n. And so, and so on, and so on. And there are others like this. Using uh, this kind of presentation, one can calculate explicitly. And object Q is equal to the kernel x r of s and m. And the direct sum of MR. So, for, for example, there is now fast. Now, now fast. So this is there is two case. X is defined by x square y q plus plus y w plus one step. This is zero, and x i is a generalization. The same thing plus y square minus w to the i minus minus w i plus n plus one. So this and one one can check that if i is between one and two n, these two n plus one singularities are all non-isomorphic. And then one can calculate the algebra. Deformation algebra or construction algebra. Okay. Uh, 
this A B is up there. This is A and B. A B plus B A and A square plus B two N plus one. And R I is equal to the same. Same and A square plus B two N plus one plus B two I. Therefore, for example, if I is bigger than two N plus one, uh, or I is bigger than N, then this is higher order term. And usually higher order term does not matter. So all, all rings with I which are bigger than N, I or I isomorphic. But actually in the non-commutative ring, this does hold. So all, all these rings uh, can be checked to be non-isomorphic. And the, the, the reason is that uh, this has odd, odd, odd power, and this is that's even power. And uh, because this is anti-symmetric, so they, they have a different contribution to the ring. Finally, uh, when I uh, mm -hmm. then uh, the the last example, the last example is the following. So this is related to KSP compact tension. So uh, example. So there, there is an exceptional vector bundles. The concept of exceptional vector bundles developed by Drusel Potier and and Golden Chef Rudakov proved that C B of P2 has semi-orthogonal decomposition to three exceptional vector bundles. So if I uh, exceptional vector bundles of rank Ri. So exceptional means that R form extension of Fi Fi is K C is zero zero otherwise. And then, uh, if I'm not leave, so if there exists some, some, some vector bundle, if I'm not leave, R1 square plus R2 square plus R3, where is three times R1 R2. So this, this is uh, one of Markov's equation, and the, such equation is satisfied if and only if there are exceptional vector bundles like this. And correspondingly, Hakim and Popo proved that P of R1, R2, R3 such such weighted projective space as Q Einstein smoothing to P2, if and only if this equation is satisfied. So 
This is a very small check, but I think it's a fine set of plus. I can try to get a result. So, yeah. But the people that I need to explain one more thing. So, so and let let us see that. So, and I can prove that in this case the ring. So dimension meta as well as so the contract the order of the extension there's no more extension and so from this that, that exists so not only defects but it is not by three and there exists local no extension so if, if I shrink uh, but I, I don't need patients, just I need to shrink a little bit, then I get this local extension. And that's done. After this change, the following points. First of all, tensors OST is on some of and this is like some I this of VI ah. so the run, run of VI is R so this is run R square and so that is correct. And moreover, it's dual. And moreover, uh, if there's some OST, so that there exists. If I take the viewers, you are the car point of correct, not only the exit. So, you are the answer, points are points. You are the answer to S. So that the difference is that here I don't need to take public and, and if, if it's a non-commutative deformation of capital 
F, so Roman F. So, but here I have uh, so in the general general case that is the different types. This different. So in the center fiber, so S and the general fiber is T, there is L to the R, so that just the same thing. And they there's a, so they branch to E1, E2, and so on. So they 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 generalize to different different vector bundles and yeah, and the F is also different because uh, F F is non-trivial extensions of Roman F, but they so There is a composition like this on the gen generic fiber. And moreover, on the gen generic fiber, they are totally disjoint. But they, they are vector bundles. So the, the support is uh, the whole, whole surface. So, but the, the form is very similar to the case of Y. So in that case, there are disjoint terms. Yeah, see, and so on. So they, they are destroyed minus or minus at all, so it's, it's natural that they are mutually orthogonal in, in this sense. But these are all vector bundles, but still they are mutually orthogonal. So in a cohomological sense, they are the same, same, same phenomena happens like this. So, like if you deform, deform uh, this muscle family, then that split into sim simple things like exceptional vector bundles, which are uh, homologically disjoint. So, and uh, in general, if, if S is a surface singularity of R one A, then and if I consider F O minus one axis, so there, there are two axes that I take this one axis and this is the minus one. Then the deformation is described in the following way. So if R, R minus R, R over R, R minus A is expanded into continuing fraction like this, then the algebra by the following equations. Cj, Cj, and Cj, 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 smaller than A, and Cj, Cj minus one, minus one, Cj minus two, so on, and Cj, Cj, Minus one if j is small, larger than j. This is 
uh, calculated by Karl uh, Karmazi. So this is this Karl uh, Karmazi algebra is uh, highly non-commutative. So you see the so order depending to the order of j and k, the equations are different. So this is quite complicated algebra, and this and, and this is a base algebra of this Basel family. But on the other hand, Basel family is a unique after isomorphism. So if you give just uh, one G F, uh, Roman F, then uh, calibrated F is uniquely determined at isomorphism. And by generic deformation, that is split into vector bundles, which are usually orthogonal, like this. So, this is a structure of the deformation of, in this case. And how, how to calculate this kind of deformation? This is also very similar to uh, actually one, one here. The sieve is one pointed, but I need hmm? a time. Ah, ah, if it is time, I, I'm okay. Yeah. Uh, I, I just uh, wanted to say that. Uh, I need a multi pointed deformation again to calculate this kind of thing. But, uh, yeah. That's, that's Thank you. 